With Ash being the protagonist to the Pokemon anime for now over 25 years, people begin to think that his journey is coming to an end. In this video, we'll go over what will happen to Ash after the Masters 8 tournament. The Masters 8 has finally begun, a final tournament for the top 8 trainers in the world to fight each other and find out who's really the strongest. And Ash is in it. Yeah, that's right. The protagonist we came to know as the guy who couldn't even win a Pokemon League has made it to the big stage and what's more, he's most likely going to reach the finals. So what could this implicate for the future of the show? So as we know, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet was announced around 4 months ago now, and obviously with every new Pokemon main series game, comes a new anime season. So will Ash just kind of go to a new region and do the same thing he's been doing every generation? I don't think it's that simple. Firstly, I'll go over some of the reasons why I believe Ash could be replaced. If Ash does reach the finals as we expect him to, that makes him literally at least the second strongest trainer in the world. I can't see how the writers could make a show around a character who's already stronger than the rest of the people. Yes, they could do what they usually do, which is to take away all Pokemon he currently has and put him in a region by himself, but would the world's strongest trainer really go out of his way to collect all the badges or whatever else they'll have in Scarlet and Violet and challenge the league in some other random region? Maybe, but wouldn't that seem like kind of a downgrade from what we're seeing right now? And would you really want to see that? Also, even if Ash loses to Leon, he's still gonna be the world's second strongest trainer which honestly doesn't make what I said any different. Also, someone in my comments suggested that they could tie in the finals, which I thought was interesting, although I really doubt it'll happen because people will be furious, I'm sure. So if Ash does beat Leon, I believe there's a very solid chance he'll be replaced as the protagonist. Maybe he'll still be there, kind of like a side character, maybe as a mentor to the new lead. Though yeah, I know, becoming the greatest trainer doesn't really mean his goal is fulfilled, because I'm sure they made his goal be Pokemon Master, because then there's an infinite amount of possibilities and an infinite amount of things that Ash can still do. And that brings me to some of the reasons Ash might still continue as the main character of the Pokemon series. Even if Ash beats Leon and even if he becomes the strongest trainer ever, that doesn't necessarily mean his journey has finished. Ash's goal is to become a Pokemon master, which has never really been clearly defined by the writers. People have theorized it means you've collected every badge in a region, or maybe you've become world champion, or maybe that you've caught all Pokemon. So while it has no clear definition, a Pokemon master is someone who strives to be the best Pokemon trainer they can possibly be. So whatever Ash does or accomplishes, there will still be more things left to do and his journey won't necessarily be over. Also, if there is going to be a Scarlet and Violet anime series, then how does the World Championships only contain people from these 8 regions? Surely they have to come up with some excuse for that. Most esports and some sports nowadays have tournaments that aren't available to all countries, so maybe that's what will happen? Ash will learn about the existence of regions that weren't included in the championships and will visit those regions only to find incredibly powerful trainers there, which would mean Ash and Leon technically shouldn't really be the actual strongest trainers in the world, since there are so many more people out there. So if Ash does get removed, who will replace him? Probably not Go. The community is not a fan of his and I'm sure the writers have caught on and won't make Go the protagonist. So it would most likely be someone we don't know yet. Who knows though, maybe Go will follow Ash in his journey to a new region. Or maybe Pokemon journeys will simply continue as new content is added. So the point I'm trying to make is, while it may seem likely that Ash gets replaced, he's basically the face of the franchise and I really think the ratings and views on the anime would decrease an insane amount if Ash is removed. But if he does stay, they really need to do it right because they've put themselves in quite the awkward situation. What do you think? Do you think Ash will be replaced after 25 years? Or do you think he'll stay in the anime moving forward? Let me know in the comments and subscribe if you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.